Greetings, Bishop Jacob, my dear brother in Christ, and all the fellow saints in India, the missionaries and the pastors, and those who serve God faithfully as they take the gospel of Jesus Christ to uh, to the great country of India. This is Pastor Paul Teske, uh, your spiritual father in the USA, uh, a, along with Rivers, my delighted wife, and we are praying over you uh, every day uh, for your ministry and for God's provision and protection and favor over all your lives and your family's lives. And we just pray that the, the gospel will continue to go out uh, and touch the nations. Now, I'm coming to you from Texas in the United States to share some teachings with you about healing and, and deliverance and, and, and ministry. And so it's my privilege and, and honor, not only to serve as Bishop Jacob's spiritual father, but also as a spiritual overseer of all of you in, in ministry in India. And it's such a privilege for me to share the teachings uh, with you right now. So I want you to just pay attention. I know Bishop Jacob's going to translate and, and share with you what I'm saying in English. If you understand English, then be blessed as you hear the teaching. And if you have to uh, have the translation, then God's going to bless you through that too. So listen, you're in my heart. You're always on my mind. I want you to know I love you and, and I bless you. And I extend my hand of blessing right now to every one of you to touch you and, and to open your ears. Let my words not be from my mouth, but from God's mouth through me to your ears, that he may speak to you with, uh, with his power and his love. And I'm going to pray that you have peace and joy and great faith and, and know the love of God completely to, to flush out all the fears and keep you in a, in a right position before the Lord as you share his word with those that need to hear and understand the gospel of Jesus Christ crucified and risen. So let me pray right now. Father God, I pray for everyone listening, that you would open their ears, that the Holy Spirit in them would help them uh, understand what I'm saying, that you would guide them and, and lead them in every step they take to bring glory and honor and praise to you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, who was crucified on the cross and rose to give us the gift of, of everlasting life. So brothers, be blessed as you as you hear my teaching and, and God bless uh, Bishop Jacob as he translates uh, with clarity to give you the full understanding of God's word and teaching as it comes from me to you, amen? So I want you to go in peace now and, and serve the Lord as you are equipped to do so, not only today, but but every single day uh, of your life. Amen? Amen.